Alexandra Daddario American Actress Alexandra Anna Daddario is an American actress. She had her breakthrough portraying Annabeth Chase in the Percy Jackson film series. She has since starred as Paige in Hall Pass, Heather Miller in Texas Chainsaw 3D, Blake Gaines in San Andreas, Summer Quinn in Baywatch, and Alexis Butler in We Summon the Darkness. Born, March 16, 1986, age 38 years, New York, New York, United States. Spouse, Andrew Form, M. 2022. Siblings, Matthew Diderio, Catherine Diderio. Parents, Christina Diderio, Richard Diderio. Height, 1.73 meters. Alexandra Anna Diderio was born on March 16, 1986 in New York City, New York, to Christina, a lawyer, and Richard Diderio, a prosecutor. Her brother is actor Matthew Diderio, her sister is actor Catherine Diderio, and her grandfather was Congressman Emilio Diderio, Emilio Q. Diderio, of Connecticut. She has Italian, Irish, Hungarian, slash Slovak ancestry. She wanted to be an actress when she was young. Her first job came at age 16, when she got the role of Lori Lewis on All My Children, 1970. Alex co-starred, with Logan Lerman and Brandon T. Jackson, in the role of Annabeth Chase in the Percy Jackson movies, Percy Jackson and the Olympians, The Lightning Thief, 2010, and Percy Jackson, Sea of Monsters, 2013, which were based on Rick Riordan's best-selling teen books. At the end of 2012, Alex starred in the music video, Imagine Dragons is Radioactive. Alexandra became more known in the 2010s, as she starred as Blake Gaines in Earthquake film San Andreas, 2015, alongside Dwayne Johnson, and in the films Hall Pass, 2011, Texas Chainsaw, 2013, and Baywatch, 2017. She has appeared on many TV series, including White Collar, 2009, it's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, 2005, and American Horror Story, 2011 Hotel. In 2014, Diderio gained attention for her role on the first season of the HBO series, True Detective, 2014. Family Spouse Andrew Form, 2021 Present Parents Christina Diderio Richard Diderio Relatives Matthew Diderio, sibling. Emilio Diderio, grandparent. Catherine Diderio, sibling. Trademarks. Strikingly bold blue eyes. Trivia. Auditioned for the lead role in Netflix's Jessica Jones. Auditioned for the role of Helena Bertinelli slash Huntress in Birds of Prey, 2020. The role eventually went to Mary Elizabeth Winstead. Bought a house in Los Angeles, California, and lives a couple of streets away from her We Have Always Lived in the Castle, 2018, co-star, Teisa Farmiga. Her parents are lawyers. Her father, Richard C. Diderio, was a federal prosecutor in New York City for 13 years before being named head of the NYC Police Department's Anti-Terrorism Bureau, in 2010. Her mother is Christina Titus. Started acting in 2002 and has also worked in music departments. It happened in an episode of The Last Man on Earth, 2015, but her very first experience was in Lie, 2006, starring Alan Miller, featuring Miranda Cosgrove. Older sister of Matthew Diderio and Catherine Diderio. Ranked number 80 on Maxim S. Hot 100 of 2014 list. Her father is 75% Italian and 25% Irish while her mother has Hungarian, Slovak, German, and English ancestry. When she was 16, she got transferred from Burley School to the Professional Children's School, in New York, so she could better focus on her acting skills. Attended Marymount Manhattan College in NYC. Announced that she is expecting her first child. She did voiceover work on I Spy School Days, a book of picture riddles. Quotes to be an actress and act crazy is really fun for me, to be able to be acting like you'd never be able to act in your real life and scream and freak out, it's an interesting test for an actor. I'm very into fantasy films. I'm really easily affected by horror films. 
I have pretty strong reactions to them. I love stories about people that, whatever situation they're in, you can relate to them in a way. I never know what's going to happen or what opportunities are going to be given to me. I found with the opportunities that I've been given have made it possible for me to explore different characters and exciting stories. I went to an all-girls school for part of high school, and the idea of boys was amazing to me, like all I ever wanted to do was kiss boys and be around boys. On the sloppiest attempt a guy's ever made to ask her out, the thing I hate most is when someone is vaguely insulting to get my attention. Once, a guy even criticized one of my movies. I'm very slow-moving with my relationships, and I prefer someone friendly and nice. You don't need to try that hard. On fitness advice she has received from Dwayne Johnson, the biggest thing I learned from Dwayne is that he has his diet, but he also has a cheat day. I really love that. If you focus on eating really healthy all week, you need the freedom to have a day to eat whatever you want and relax. If you get burned out, you're not going to reach your goals, physical or otherwise. Tweeted about Barack Obama seeing her in True Detective, the president has seen my boobs, performing nude helping her career, I have a lot of thoughts on this topic, but for example, when True Detective came out and I was naked on the show, and it was huge for my career and the phone was ringing and I got some work off of it, I think that I hadn't been that aware of my sex appeal prior to that. I tried not to take it too seriously. I really love acting, in my heart I'm just a theater nerd, and I sort of took that and said, this is good for my career and embraced it.